I hope my sweet ass husband realizes. I almost died and nearly got in a fist fight coming here to pick up the beer he wants. Seriously? Why does it have to be like this? Now that I think of it, purchasing gummy bears at that old busted ass liquor store is probably not the best thing. I could break a tooth. You all know how much I love clickbait. I also love Instagram stories. I love telling you way too much about myself, but I am gonna share something important with you. Tomorrow, my life is changing forever. I have big news. Yep, big news. I have big news tomorrow. And I'm gonna share with you. So make sure you come visit me on Instagram. It's that time of the month again, when I save a buck and color my own hair. Uh, I don't know if my dinner is hurting my feelings or pissing me off. But I think it's the latter. Sweet dreams. See you tomorrow. Good morning, happy snappy friends. Well, today is the big day. I'm on my way. Wish me luck. Today is the big day. I'm here. And so that I would look fresh, prepared, and worthy, I colored my gray last night because I didn't want to have a bunch of gray hair. But I suck at that. And you probably can't see it, but I have a line of demarcation all around my head because I did it myself, so I look like a doll head. Just call me Doll Head Nina. I got up really early for this, and I'm so nervous. I always get really lost when I come here. Oh my God, this beautiful tree makes me feel so happy on such a busy, important day. Apparently, I'm supposed to provide the court with a self-addressed stamped envelope. Hey guys, I can't wait to tell you my good news. I'm here outside at work and just enjoying the view and celebrating this glorious news that I have because today I am a brand new, redefined, rebranded, totally different human being than I was when I was born. It's been in the making for several months, but I decided to change my name, not just my married name, not just my last name, but my whole entire name, you know, like Prince and Madonna. When I was born, my parents named me after the Mistress of the Dark, Elvira. It's actually my grandma's name, but it's so confusing. And then they gave me the middle name of my other grandma, Christine, which is really pretty. Both names are really gorgeous right now, and it's actually fun to go places and tell people that my name is Elvira. But I don't use that name, and it just got really hard. And it got really hard to carry all kinds of names because then when I got remarried, I had another last name in addition to my kids' last name. So then I was Elvira, Christine, Killian, Russell, but people call me Nina. That's confusing. And then there's my maiden name. It just adds so many levels of confusion. It like never ended. And so I changed my name. And I didn't even give myself a middle name because middle names are so stupid. What are they even there for? It cost me almost $1,000. I had to spend all kinds of time in court. I had to go see the judge today, but he said yes. And now I am officially Oh shoot, I spelt my name wrong on that last Insta story where it only had one L, but I'm pretty sure I did it right on the court paperwork, so let's just go back. But I don't want to retake that snap because the wind's not blowing as much. It was really cool, so too well. I know you all probably think it's not that big of a deal because you call me Nina, but it's a super big deal. It is a life-changing big deal. And I was really emotional about it and my heart was beating so much. My knees were really weak. It took a lot of guts.